it happened to a buddy of mine a couple of years ago. We were we were smoking at, at the uh, at the Lafayette uh, statue, and it took him away. And it took him to uh, some detention center over in Alexandria. And it was on a Saturday. They didn't let him out until Monday. And then they stole like all of his money and the money in his pocket. He got out with. His... That's what they do though. At some point, all your shit disappears or messed up. In fact, when I came here, I started to leave my phone because I was thinking to myself, I don't want to lose my phone. If I get arrested, man, somebody might jack my phone. Get all your contacts. <laughs> yeah. Put around the end of calling Crip. And I, I decided, man, I gotta come here. I've been to one man game so many times by myself. And I was like, man, I gotta go support this dude. I'm gonna come to Washington. I'm glad I got a ride. Man. Yo, my man. Bardo, wait a minute, let's talk to Bardo a second. Now, I know y'all got a lot of video of him. Bardo volunteered this morning to give me a ride here. He gave me a ride. He's an Iraqi war veteran, you know, he's a cannabis consumer, and he's totally down on, on, on freedom of speech and all that. In fact, you can introduce yourself. Hello, my name is Bernardo Bardo. I'm just here, you know, supporting this movement of activism against people trying to demonize a plant that should not be demonized in the first place. It's the healing of the nation. It needs to be freed up. More people need to know about this because we get together and it seems like we preach to the choir, but we need to reach those people that don't really know that the, the, the plant isn't really as bad as the government is making it out to see. It's an absolute lie. It is a lie. It's an outright lie, and, you know, they're deceiving all these people, and it's sad to see all these people really take the side of law enforcement and putting people like uh, my friend here behind bars and, and ruining people's lives. It really messes people's lives up, you know, when... Uh, the, the law messes you up. Exactly. It, it's, it, like like my man said, it's not it's not us that's wrong, it's the law that's wrong. They're, they're the one that, that's demonizing the plant. The plant, there's nothing wrong with the plant. I mean, if we're saying that all these pharmaceuticals are okay, all these people are walking around with a happy smile and letting us consume these things and being happy with it and it's killing us, there's something really wrong with with, with yeah. these people. They're disinformed. Now, everything he's saying, he's, he's saying it from the perspective of a, of a, of a war veteran who's, who's seen combat, who has earned his right. First of all, we've all been born here, so we have that right, but he's earned his right to speak out here. And as far as he is a, 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 a brother and a kindred spirit with um, Adam. They're both served in Iraq. And this is the face of an American patriot right here. Right here. As ugly as you see with the town and the hair on my face, you know, I'm just opposite of what the system wants me to do because I know that the system is wrong. It's not us, the people, that's wrong. It's them that's wrong. So when you see us like this, we look this way because we, we are against nonconformance. Yeah, nonconformance of, of, of these laws that, the, you know, that, they're, that they're putting upon us. Not all of them are right, yeah. Some of them are right, but a lot of them are wrong. This uh, this thing against this prohibition against marijuana, dead wrong. Because you got pharmaceutical drugs just wiping us out every day. You don't have not one not one death from cannabis, and you telling me you want to make this plant illegal? To get real, that's all I really have to say for today. I appreciate your time. Thank you. It's your boy Crip Brown Paul. This is Adam vs. Man. Don't forget June 30th, Smoke Down Part Six in Philadelphia. Until next time. Well, you don't always have to smoke it. <laughs> take, take <laughs> Remember to encrypt and back up your wallet and store your password in a safe place. Smoke it anyway! Smoke it anyway!